Jesus Christ the greatest king, the greatest Jew, the greatest high priest. Matthew chapter 2 verse 2. 2 saying, Where is he that is born king of the Jews? For we have seen his star in the east, and are come to worship him. Mark 15 verse 2. 2 and Pilate asked him, Art thou the king of the Jews? And he answering said unto them, Thou sayest it. Matthew chapter 27 verse 37. 37 and set up over his head his accusation written, This is Jesus the King of the Jews. Mark 15 verse 9. 9 But Pilate answered them, saying, Will ye that I release unto you the King of the Jews? Luke chapter 23 verse 38. 38 and a superscription also was written over him in letters of Greek, and Latin, and Hebrew. This is the King of the Jews. John chapter 19 verse 3. 3 and said, Hail, King of the Jews. And they smote him with their hands. Matthew chapter 27 verse 11. 11 and Jesus stood before the governor, and the governor asked him, saying, Art thou the king of the Jews? And Jesus said unto him, Thou sayest. Luke chapter 23 verse 3. 3 And Pilate asked him, saying, Art thou the king of the Jews? And he answered him and said, Thou sayest it. John chapter 18 verse 33. 33 Then Pilate entered into the judgment hall again, and called Jesus, and said unto him, Art thou the king of the Jews? John chapter 1 verse 11. 11 He came unto his own, and his own received him not. Mark 15 verse 32. Let Christ the King of Israel descend now from the cross, that we may see and believe. And they that were crucified with him reviled him. John chapter 19 verse 19. 19 And Pilate wrote a title, and put it on the cross. And the writing was Jesus of Nazareth the King of the Jews. John chapter 18 verse 39. 39 But ye have a custom, that I should release unto you one at the Passover. Will ye therefore that I release unto you the King of the Jews? Jesus Christ gave up his life by himself. John chapter 10 verse 18. 18 No man taketh it from me, but I lay it down of myself. I have power to lay it down, and I have power to take it again. This commandment have I received of my Father. Jesus Christ the Father. John chapter 14 verses 8 and 9. 8 Philip saith unto him, Lord, show us the Father, and it suffice thus. 9 Jesus saith unto him, Have I been so long time with you, and yet hast thou not known me, Philip? He that hath seen me hath seen the Father. And how sayest thou then, Show us the Father? Jesus Christ has the keys of hell and death. Revelation chapter 1 verses 18. 18 I am he that liveth, and was dead. And, behold, I am alive for evermore, Amen. And have the keys of hell and of death. Jesus Christ went to speak to the spirits in prison. 1 Peter chapter 3 vs 19. 19 By which also he went and preached unto the spirits in prison. To proclaim victory over death. By Jesus Christ were all things created. Colossians chapter 1 verses 16 to 20. 16 For by him were all things created, that are in heaven, and that are in earth, visible and invisible whether they be thrones, or dominions, or principalities, or powers. All things were created by him, and for him. 17 And he is before all things, and by him all things consist. 18 And he is the head of the body, the church. Who is the beginning, the firstborn from the dead. 
that in all things he might have the preeminence. 19 For it pleased the Father that in him should all fullness dwell. 20 And, having made peace through the blood of his cross, by him to reconcile all things unto himself. By him, I say, whether they be things in earth, or things in heaven. Jesus Christ in him dwelleth all the fullness of the Godhead bodily. Colossians chapter 2 verses 9-11 9 For in him dwelleth all the fullness of the Godhead bodily. 10 And ye are complete in him, which is the head of all principality and power. 11 In whom also ye are circumcised with the circumcision made without hands, in putting off the body of the sins of the flesh by the circumcision of Christ. Jesus Christ spiritual food for those who thirst and hunger. Matthew chapter 25 verses 35 to 43. 35 For I was an hungred, and ye gave me meat. I was thirsty, and ye gave me drink. I was a stranger, and ye took me in. 36 Naked, and ye clothed me. I was sick, and ye visited me. I was in prison, and ye came unto me. 37 Then shall the righteous answer him saying, Lord, when saw we thee an hungred, and fed thee? Or thirsty, and gave thee drink? 38 When saw we thee a stranger, and took thee in? Or naked, and clothed thee? 39 Or when saw we thee sick, or in prison, and came unto thee? 40 And the king shall answer and say unto them, Verily I say unto you, Inasmuch as ye have done it unto one of the least of these my brethren, ye have done it unto me. 41 Then shall he say also unto them on the left hand, Depart from me, ye cursed, into everlasting fire, prepared for the devil and his angels. 42 For I was an hungred, and ye gave me no meat. I was thirsty, and ye gave me no drink. 43 I was a stranger, and ye took me not in. Naked, and ye clothed me not. Sick, and in prison, and ye visited me not. Jesus Christ the Alpha and Omega. Revelation chapter 22 verses 13 to 21. 13 I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last. 14 Blessed are they that do his commandments that they may have right to the tree of life, and may enter in through the gates into the city. 15 For without are dogs, and sorcerers, and whoremongers, and murderers, and idolaters, and whosoever loveth and maketh a lie. 16 I Jesus have sent mine angel to testify unto you these things in the churches. I am the root and the offspring of David, and the bright and morning star. 17 And the Spirit and the Bride say, Come. And let him that heareth say, Come. And let him that is a thirst come. And whosoever will, let him take the water of life freely. 18 For I testify unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book. If any man shall add unto these things, God shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book. 19 And if any man shall take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, God shall take away his part out of the book of life, and out of the holy city, and from the things which are written in this book. 20 He which testifieth these things saith, Surely I come quickly. Amen. Even so, come, Lord Jesus. 21 The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. Amen. Jesus Christ is freedom and salvation. Galatians chapter 5 verse 1. 5 It is for freedom that Christ has set us free. Stand firm, then, and do not let yourselves be burdened again by a yoke of slavery.